There are beginner fountain pens. There are intermediate fountain pens. And then there are fancy fountain pens. If you've fallen down this particular rabbit hole, you probably know some of the more popular options, like the Sailor Pro Gear and Pro Gear Slim, Lamy 2000, and Platinum 3776 Century. It's time to shine a light on some extravagant fountain pens we carry that you may never have heard of. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for more swanky content like this. Let's get started. The 22 Studio Contour is made with concrete. Its industrial look, available in light and dark gray, is molded with subtle grooves and is contrasted by metal details. We should note that the concrete barrel may crack if you accidentally drop it or hit it against a hard surface. So store it in a pen sleeve or case when transporting it around. In a world full of plastic and metal fountain pens, the elegant look and distinct feel of a wooden pen is unrivaled. E&M is best known for making wooden nib holders for calligraphy, so it makes sense that the barrels of their contract fountain pens are made with wood too. The caps can be posted by screwing them onto the backs of the pens, and studs on the caps stop them from rolling away. A long version of the E&M contract is available for those with larger hands or if you just prefer a larger pen. Whether you're landlocked or at sea, make a splash with this nautical-themed noveler fountain pen. It has a piston filling mechanism and a high ink capacity, with porthole-style windows in the barrel that let you see your remaining ink level. The Nautilus is made of ebonite, a vulcanized rubber that was typically used for fountain pens in the early 20th century prior to plastic becoming prevalent. Choose from pens named after coral, catfish, or cephalopods. Don't be fooled by the basic looks of the Otto Hut Design 6. Its classic cigar-shaped barrel is made of lightweight aluminum with a pleasantly textured finish, tapered at each end for a balanced feel in the hand. The grip section also incorporates a tapered shape and flares out, preventing fingers from choking up towards the nib. This pen's cap unscrews with less than half a turn, so you can write at a moment's notice. It's quadruple threaded for closing securely when you're finished. Just to be safe, we recommend storing the Design 6 in a case that has individual slots, like the Esterbrook pen roll. That way, you'll eliminate the possibility of jostling the pen around and accidentally uncapping it. ST Dupont, a Parisian luxury goods company, is famous for manufacturing not only wallets and watches, but fountain pens as well. The Défi Millennium has a sleek yet sporty brass body, with polished chrome and eye-catching colored lacquer finishes. Plus, it features some notable details not found on many fountain pens. A hooded nib is less likely to dry out than a standard one, and adds to the Diffie's aerodynamic look, while the magnetic snap-on cap offers a robust and satisfying closure. Be sure to keep this pen away from anything that can be affected by magnets, though. Those who know Visconti know the Homo sapiens, the fountain pen made with basaltic lava rock. But if its understated colors aren't for you, check out the Kaleido. Made in collaboration with Jonathan Brooks of the Carolina Pen Company, it's available in vibrant fire opal and glittery unicorn galaxy. The Kaleido still utilizes iconic elements that you would expect from a Visconti pen, like the hook safe lock cap mechanism, spring loaded art clip, and power filler vacuum filling system. The Waldman Tango is a statement piece for any fountain pen collection. It's made of 925 sterling silver, an alloy that's made of 92.5% pure silver and 7.5% other metals. This alloy is more durable than pure silver and therefore ideal for the production of fountain pens. The Tango is available in different stunning finishes that exude a luxe yet timeless look. It even comes with a polishing cloth for keeping your pen nice and shiny. Searching for a fountain pen that'll last you a lifetime and more? 
Look no further than the Y-Studio Classic Revolve. This brass pen has a matte lacquer finish that will wear off over time, exposing the brass body underneath and developing a patina as you use it. Y-Studio includes a sheet of sandpaper if you want to speed up that aging process or customize the look of your pen. A raw brass version is available if you want to skip these steps. Those that like the look of the Classic Revolve will appreciate Y-Studio's ballpoint and rollerball pens, as well as pencils that share the same aesthetic. Which of these fountain pens did you like the best? Let us know in the comments below. You can find all the products in the description and on jetpens.com, the place for pen and stationery lovers. Be sure to check out our playlist linked in the card to see more luxurious fountain pens. Thanks for watching!